This is one of my first ever digital landscape paintings that I made. And it was one that I was actually really proud of when I made it. Even looking back, I still think it was pretty decent for what I could do at the time. I do know there's a lot of things I see that I could improve upon. And that's why I decided, let's repaint it. See what different stuff I could come up with, with a four-year experience difference. And we'll see what I make out of it. So I start off by blocking in the colors. For most of the painting, I only use three layers. The beginning, I start with just two. I have the sky, and then I have the midground, and then... For the foreground, I just have a tree and a little bit of grass. Basically paint with only three layers for the whole painting. The background, midground, and foreground. And this tree is what I spend most of the time on. I jump back and forth. So some of the biggest changes that I've made in the painting was the trees. Obviously, the foreground tree is completely different. I also changed the colors a bit. More of a yellow color palette than orange. And I varied the trees by adding, because in the original one, they are kind of all like one clump. But I add some overlap and bring some, some of the trees forward onto the right to give them more depth to it. And I also change up the color in them as well. In my original one, I made way too many layers. I had a layer for every single thing in the painting, and that just is overwhelming. So I've kind of streamlined it to only a few layers now. I don't think I even use a perspective grid in this, but I did in the original one. And I also changed the reflections in the water because before they were kind of splotchy, but I kind of cleared them up a little bit because water has more of a clear look to it. And it picks up a lot more colors than I was getting in the other one. It was a lot more gray. But also it was more overcast, so that made sense for that one as well. I kind of wanted to brighten up the painting too. I just felt like it fit this painting a lot better. And I got really... The rendering of the water is a lot better in this one. Work on this tree quite a bit. And I like the shapes in it a lot more. Especially the leaves and the foliage in it. Compared to the original, because there's more color in it. The other one was kind of blotchy and one like big big chunk of foliage on it and it's just on the top. This one has a little more um you can see more going on with the branches. It seems more realistic. I did really struggle. I still struggled with the foliage, especially in the right upper right of the tree, and that was kind of an issue. But that's okay. And I tried messing around with some light rays coming through the tree. And I just couldn't get that quite to work. Sometimes there's just things you try. If you can't figure it out, move on and just leave it out of the painting. And with this tree, I made several layers on top of it that I merged down over time. <clears throat> just to try and figure out the foliage. Because it was still a pain. And I kind of moved out the... I flattened out the pond too. So it's less rounded in the back, which I think it makes it look, makes things look less wonky. And also the mountain I pushed further back into the background and made the clouds more loose. I was more loose with my clouds. And the mountain, especially, I got rid of the details and kind of flattened it a little bit, which helps push it further back into the atmosphere a bit to give more depth to the painting overall. For one of my first digital paintings I ever made, it was pretty good and I was proud of it. And I made, I've made so many improvements over the last four years, like it's so crazy to see the difference between the two. And it was really interesting going back and comparing them. It took me a while to gather my ideas on this. I would recommend repainting your old stuff, kind of like how I did it, and just Try and take like the core of it and just get rid of that image for a while so you have more original thoughts come to the front of your mind and just practice more. And until next time, Dargon out.